Welcome to another edition of A Bowling Conversation with me, your boy, L-I-N-G, a.k.a. everybody's favorite hidden character, where I go ahead and try these different cereals out and see what uh, I think of them and tell you what I think of them. Uh, sometime I have a guest, sometime like I'm doing right now solo, it turns to a Digging in a Crate edition, where I go ahead and hurry up and dig in a crate of cereal I have and hurry up and eat it before it expires. The day I said, forget it, man. We're going to go ahead and bust open this uh, Frosted Flakes Pumpkin Spice. Actually, a limited edition, to be honest with you. Uh, why not? I'm thinking, hell, my favorite season fall is almost, well, ain't no almost. It, it's dead. It's done for this year. It's already kicking in winter time. Why not? I should have did this in the fall time, but why not do it now? So what I do first I actually do something I call a dry test, and that is something for all you new viewers where I actually eat the cereal dry, and we'll find out if it's a little snack or something to see if it's something that you'll take to work or something that the kids will take to school. I'll rate it like, uh, what is it, one, a scale to one to five. So we're gonna see what this uh, limited edition pumpkin spice uh, frosted flakes got going on. Uh, yeah, we're going to see what it's made out of. But sometimes the cereal tastes different when you don't have no milk. Sometimes I don't have cereal where it tastes good dry. Like I said, it's called a dry test. But um, tastes better dry than actually with the milk. Or had it where it tastes not so great dry. And when you hit it with the milk, it turned to a different ball game. We'll do that in a few minutes. But right now, I'm not going to lie. This might be good. Because as soon as I cracked it open, you can smell that. You can smell that. Let's see what we got going on. Man. I don't know what Frosted Flakes is doing. But it's doing this thing. You can taste that. For you pumpkin spice eaters, I mean, well, tasty, tasters, whatever you want to say. I'm not saying I'm the greatest, I mean, that's not my greatest flavor, but. That's good, man. Actually good. And the crazy thing is, like I said, Frosted Flakes been winning. When I was younger, I didn't even eat it like that. You new flavors? Look, got me looking at the box like I don't know what I'm eating. So from a scale, like I said, with the dry test of one to five. <sighs> Why not, man? I'm going to give it a four easy. It's, it's almost tipping the five, but I'm like not too much of a pumpkin spice eater like that. But I like getting like cookies and stuff. But uh, scale to one to five, four easy. Smell it everything. So next... Or y'all that tune with me usually, or people that's new tuning in. This is old trusty. This is a bowl I didn't have for years. And next, I'm gonna go ahead and hit it what I call the Saturday morning special. That's when I hit it with the milk. And when I do that Saturday morning special, that's a scale to one to ten. That's when we boost it up. So I talked to my man Danny. He got on me talking about I need a better, better sound system. He want to work with me on when I do these episodes. Uh, my man Danny from uh, my hood, the Hilltop West Side Slice. Shout out to him. Always show me love when I go there. Good pizza. Also to my cousin Chuck. Ain't seen you in a while. <laughs> so. We're going to see with the Saturday morning special. We're going to hit it with this milk. Frosted Flakes, y'all been doing y'all thing, man. I'm not even going to lie. I got to stir mine, y'all. Got to stir, got to stir. So we got... Got 
Damn, this is tasty. It got me flinging milk. You see me looking. Across this place, I don't know what y'all been doing, man. But y'all, y'all, maybe I missed out eating with y'all as a, you know, eating this more as a kid. I don't know. I'm not gonna say that because they did not have all these flavors. This pumpkin spice ain't bad, man. This ain't a bad cereal. You gotta forgive me, I'm trying to get some good crunches in to see. What I'm gonna do from the scale to one to ten. Mm. Man, from a scale to one to ten, man. This an easy. Man, this an easy for man. I was not a pumpkin spice eater like that, but I, I keep saying that, but I, I'm like, I don't wanna be biased because of that. But I'm gonna go ahead and give this an eight easy, man. This is an easy eight. And I think somebody that actually like pumpkin spice stuff, where y'all pumpkin spice eaters that really like the taste of it, y'all definitely gonna yo, we'll give it a nine. I'm gonna give it an eight. But for y'all, y'all, oh well, man, I'll be messing up. I got I gotta get somebody on here with the conversation to really. This is where I should have had somebody that like pumpkin spice like that. Like I think y'all probably would have went crazy. Frosted Flakes been winning, like, like every time I do an episode, um, I'm not even going to just say that, but it's helping me win. Every time I do an episode with Frosted Flakes, for y'all that look at my videos on a regular, I appreciate y'all, but it's like my ratings go up, and I, I don't understand why. <laughs> I mean, my views go up. Like, for instance, I had did uh, Frosted Flakes, uh, I want to say... I think the first one was Shaq with the basketballs in it. At that time, I just started out. It was like, went up like 700 views. I did one with the uh, Frosted Flakes French Toast. That mug hit 1.5K. So I appreciate y'all checking me out. I'm sorry I haven't been on my my uh, swivel, more on my, on my craft. I, I vowed this time I need to get more on and have fun with it. I was taking it too serious, trying to get the views, like, so I'm just going to be me. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what it's just going to roll down to. Definitely going to have more people in here. I'm going to just get out my shell. I've been kind of hiding from the world, man, to be more, you know, uh, more social, where I just have somebody come over and eat this with me, because this definitely would have been one I wish I would have had the pumpkin spice eaters. Again, like I said, hey, Frosted Flakes, y'all, y'all, y'all been winning, man. Like, you know what I'm going to have to do? I'm going to have to go ahead and probably go ahead and get that uh, Frosted Flakes uh, strawberry milkshake. I had it before, but I'm, I'm going to have to rate it. I actually gave it to my son, if I ain't mistaken. I gave it to, shout outs to my girl, Lady Guillotine, Sunita. Um, yeah, man. Appreciate all of y'all for uh, liking, subscribing, uh, commenting. I love the comments, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate y'all support me on, on the journey. So, you know, like I always tell y'all, I don't ever want to say goodbye. I always say to be continued.